Hey guys, so for today's tutorial, it's going to be a pretty quick one. I just really wanted to do like that glowy wet skin look without really using any setting powder except for, you know, under my eyes and my smile lines because I'm a creasy mess. But yeah, so it's pretty quick and it's one of my favorite, like these are my favorite go-to products when I just want to use creams and not set my whole face. So, I really hope you guys enjoy this tutorial, and I'll catch you guys later. So, the first thing I'm going to go in with is a primer. And I'm going to use this Pure Correcting Primer, and I wanted to use this one because it's an Illuminate and Glow Primer. But before that, I'm going to go in with this Makeup Forever Step 1 Skin Equalizer, just to put right here where I have the largest pores. So that way, once we put that on... We can go in with the illuminating primer. And I like to tap it and kind of um, swipe at the same time, but just lightly because you really want to like push it into those pores. Okay. Now I'm going to go in with the illuminating primer. I dab it all over first. like some weird stuff in my face right now. Okay. And then I'm just gonna kind of rub, but also pat. And I like to go right over that spot that we just put primer on to make sure that it's not gonna be dry looking because I do have really dry skin. And this is a primer that becomes like really tacky once you put it on. So then you're ready. Okay. So for foundation, I'm going with my new favorite. This is a L'Oreal Pro Glow. And I'm in the shade 201 Classic Ivory. And with this stuff, I'm going to use my damp um, sponge. And I'm just going to put it right on the back of it. And then I'm going to dab it all over my face. Don't forget the neck because I'm pretty pale. For some reason this foundation has like little white specks when I put it on. That I just have to like blend out. It's pretty weird though. And we're just going to keep on blending. It is a little bit too, like, peachy for me, but that's okay. I can look past that because once we put, like, the yellow-based concealer on, it kind of cancels it out, so it's not too bad. Then I'm just going to add a little bit more to my neck. Just to make sure my face isn't the only pink thing. Now to correct my under eye circles, I'm going to go in with the Becca Under Eye Brightener. Under each eye and then dab it up. This really, really helps with correcting those dark circles. Okay, then I'm gonna do some cream contour and I'm taking this Smashbox Masterclass Palette and I'm gonna be using this shade right here for the like contour bronzer and then a mixture of these two shades for my blush. To take this Real Techniques expert face brush and going with that I'm actually going to put a little bit of this cover FX C a lemongrass drops so I'm gonna drop it right into the bronzer I really hope my camera doesn't die on me right now because I'm gonna be really sad and then you pretty much just blend away 
And once you get to like your cheekbones, you want to blend up, not down. Because if you blend down, then you're kind of contradicting yourself, I guess. Because you want to slim the face. And then once you feel like it's pretty blended out, I'm just going to put the extra on my nose. That's when, oh, I feel so tan. <laughs> then I'm going to go in with the blush on that same brush. And I like to do all this before I do my concealer, just in case I get it a little too high up. So then I can like clean it off and not have to really worry about it. Put a little bit there right there. Okay. And then we're going to do the highlight after we do the concealer. So now for concealer, I'm taking my NARS Radiant Creamy Concealer. And this is going to be the only thing that we're going to set with powder today. So just like normal. Straight under. I'm also going to put that down the nose, in between the eyebrows, and on the chin, and then a little bit right here. Just to clean that up. And for that down here, I'm going to use my brush. Okay, now with my damp sponge, I'm going to blend out the rest. Okay, now I'm gonna set my under eyes with the Maybelline Fit Me Matte and Portless Shade 100 Translucent. And I just take this side of the sponge and just swirl it. And I'm just gonna get right underneath. That's the only spot that I want. Then, if you kind of wiped away any of it, you can always go back in, darken it up. And I'm going to put a little bit on the side of my nose with my sponge. And then dab it out with my finger. Okay, now for highlight. So I'm going to take that same palette and I'm going to grab this shade right here. This is the highlighting shade. It's called Luminous Gold. And I'm going to take the back of this again, put some of this that lemongrass drops in it and then just go ham I guess <laughs> it's such a beautiful do you see that now I put on my nose upper lip chin right above my eyebrows I'm totally kidding all over You know what? I'm gonna put a little bit more blush, actually. There we go. Okay, now I'm gonna go put on some lower lash, lower lash mascara and put a little bit of stuff underneath my eyes and then we are done.